Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about continuity. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this critical thinking question. Give an example of a function with discontinuities at x equals 1, 2, and 3. Now there are many answers here that work, but mainly here I'm trying to find discontinuity, and the best way to do that really is well, divide by zero, right? When our function divides by zero, and make that happen when x is one, two, and three. So again, there's many answers, but if we say f of x is equal to one over here, watch this, if I put an x minus one, I plug one in, that denominator equals zero. I do an x minus two next to it, plug two in, we're dividing by zero again. And lastly, x minus three. Put a three in for x, that becomes zero, we're dividing by zero. And so that's it. There are many answers here for this final function, but here's an example of one. f of x is equal to one over x minus one, x minus two, uh, x minus one times x minus two times x minus three. Here's an example of a function with discontinuities at x equals one, two, and three. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.